Hello. Hello. Uh, I want to to think if you have ever mistaken a friend, a strange for a friend. No. Okay. Mm. So, Emma, have you ever? Strange mistakes. Yeah. Yes? Yes. And how about you, Chloe? Yeah, of course. And you, Karen? Yeah. I have a really funny story about that. I'll <laughs> <laughs> After your presentation. So, yes. Okay. <laughs> well, today I'm, I will talk about my awesome thing. It's mistaking a strange for a friend. And I will tell you uh, what I'm talking about. And after, things that you can do in this situation. And finally, my experience. So let's begin. No, you have to click the icon the bottom. Pardon me? The bottom. You have to make a full screen. Here? No. Oh, yeah. What is your? No, full oh. screen. Yeah, it will work. Thank you. <laughs> okay, have you ever had experience when you were walking in the yeah. street and suddenly you saw you saw some someone across the street from you and you really thought that was your friend. So you walked up to him and you after you <laughs> his uh, his shoulder or her shoulder and when he turned it around you realize that it's a completely stranger. <laughs> so I know, I believe that maybe you you felt the most stupid person in the world. But no worries. It's not only you. Everyone, everybody feels the same. Uh, if you if you have if you have never had this experience or if you had but you don't know how to how to react, I will tell you today a couple of things that you can do in this experience. So let's go for my first tip. If you don't have enough imagina imagination, you can only say, I'm sorry, <laughs> I just confused you with one of my friends. My second tip is if your mind is a, is a, a bit faster, you can ask, you can simulate that you are lost in the street and you can ask for another song in <laughs> each direction. Like, it's a second option. So the, the person that you are confusing, uh, it won't be that you are awkward, it's only lost. Uh, the third tip is you can just run away and ignore the situation. <laughs> if you are so afraid and you can you can just simulate that it was a mistake that if you don't call any name and you are only like oh sorry and then go so, and nobody maybe he he can think like oh like oh okay maybe she she touched me by accident and after she go uh, the last tip is you can say that you mistook him or her with an for an artist. Oh, I was thinking you were Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, yeah. oh, I was thinking you were Megan Fox. Oh. So you don't know. Uh, if if you if you think that he or he or her is sexy or is nice or is pretty, you can introduce yourself and say, "Oh, hello, nice to meet you." <laughs> and you don't know if they work, and you have a new friend only because you uh, misunderstood him for a stranger. Uh, the stranger for a friend, sorry. Okay, now I I already tell I already told you that tips that you can do. Now I will tell my story. One day I was walking in the street and uh, I saw one of my friends across uh, and I walked up to him and I touched his uh, his shoulder and when he turned it around. Oh, because I said I said his name. I said hello, Eduardo. When he turned around, <laughs> was a completely stranger. So I want to ask you, which, which was my reaction? It's not this team. It's another team. Norica, what do you think that I did? Mm -hmm. You said, oh, I thought you're not real. 
No. How about you, Tay? You were shocked. Like, no. Election. How are you, Emma? Um, just pretend you call another person like <laughs> beside him or... Oh, no, but that's good. <laughs> no, I asked what time is it? <laughs> Nobody needs to know that you confuse someone with a strange. Thank you. <laughs> 